So this is the last video in the series about this excavator. Um, it took a long time to get here, but it's done. Um, it's dirty because, again, I've been driving it and playing around with it. But And of course, the lights work. It's got an adjustable boom. So, so I ended up making more of a demolition excavator than a actual digging excavator. But that's not a big deal. I like it. I like how it came out. Uh, let's see. And of course, it dries. So it's fully functional and it digs very well. Um, go over some of the stuff that I did since the last time you guys seen it. Of course, I put the driver in there. The cab has a voltage rig, that's what that blue light is, it has a voltage uh, uh, readout in it so I can see what the voltage is. There's also one here behind this plate, but I'm not going to take it off. Uh, the battery sits here. Counterweight. I'll, I know I said I wanted to have it so it, it uh, was magnetically put on, but now it's, it's glued on because it's an actual counterweight now. There's a bunch of uh, steel bar in here. Weight-wise, I don't know. It's probably about 15, 20 pounds. It's not as... It's almost. I'm going to say not as much, but... Oh, it's almost as much as that guy, as my uh, Double E Hobbies one. But the Double E Hobbies one is, uh, it's just ca uh, die cast. I mean, the whole thing. So, of course, it's going to be just heavy. Where the one I built is plastic and aluminum and some 3D printed parts. So, it's not going to be as heavy as the uh, Double the E Hobby one. Now, this is it for this excavator. This whole iteration of this machine that has been around since, I don't want to say tw uh, 2012 or so, um, it's done. The next step for it is to get a new one and sell it for parts. <laughs> so this is the last time you guys are going to see me talk about it or anything like that. But it's what I wanted it to be. I wanted one just for a, a digging machine. Not one that's going to be for all the other little stuff I might do when I play with it. Um, but yeah, I got I got what I wanted. It was a good little project. It was fun. It was easy. Um, I know I haven't been posting that much on the uh, the website, but I've been busy at work and busy with a lot of other stuff. And I don't know if you guys are affected if you live in America like I do, but it's been... Money has been kind of tight, so little toys are not exactly something that uh, I can spend a lot of my money on right now. But I'm going to try to do more videos. Um, my next project, I'm, I'm in the process of thinking, do I want to build another dump truck or do I want to do another piece of heavy equipment or do I want to do... A crawler or a touring car. I would like to do a touring car, even though, even though guys on the site don't tend to like that kind of stuff. They tend to like my heavy equipment more than anything. But I would love to do a touring car. Um, but I want a nice one. If I was going to do one, it would probably be a TAO eight or something comparable to that. It it won't be a TTO two, and I'm probably lying to you because the TTO twos come with bodies where the TE the TAO eight doesn't. Um, I'm not really into drift cars, but it might even be one of those. But anyway, that's the video.